everyone, welcome, and thank you for joining me for the fourth part of my playthrough of Control. Let's jump into the story together and see what happens. While you're enjoying, will you please take a minute to help me out by liking this video, subscribing to my channel if you haven't already, clicking the notification bell, sharing with a friend, and comment below what you thought about the video. I hope you enjoy, and thanks again for watching. Trench was furious. You don't think Darling? Don't be stupid. What would the bureau's golden child have to gain from killing the boss? Possible directorship? Jesse, you made it. And you lifted the internal lockdown. Let's talk, Emily. Yes, of course. Listen, Emily. <sighs> Screw it. Just tell her. I haven't been completely honest. I have a younger brother, Dylan. When we were kids, we found an old slide projector in Ordinary's landfill. The slides created doorways to other places. Bad things happened. Came through. That's all she gets. The rest stays locked inside. But we found help. Through one of the doorways, we... met something. A being. A being? What kind of being? It's hard to describe, but it... She helped us. We managed to turn the projector off, the bad things that came through the doorways were gone. After that, your people came, tried to grab us. I ran away. They got Dylan. I left him behind. Bureau agents took your brother? Yes. You covered it up. No one believed me. I just want to find Dylan. I've been looking for him ever since. What happened to the slide projector? It sounds like another object of power. I thought you took it. The Bureau. Along with Dylan. I've never heard of it. But around here, I assume everything's classified. You know, I looked into the ordinary AWE case files after you mentioned it. Trench and Darling were both involved. A large area of the containment sector was reserved for it. The case hasn't been active for a long time. I have no idea if anything's still there. Can you tell me more about this being you found? Let's hope you two get along. She's been with me ever since ordinary. In my head. She led me to you. I call her... Polaris. As in, a guiding star. Did Polaris know about the Hiss? If she got you in here, in spite of the lockdown, she's very powerful. Which may help explain your test results. Your readings are incredible, Jesse. Now, cross-referencing them with the database, I found two matches in Darling's old classified files. Unfortunately, I can't access them beyond the file codes, but one was P6, referring to a prime candidate for a potential future bureau director. Uh, this was logged years ago. Dylan. Is that Dylan? The other match is on something called Hedron, which must be connected to these Hedron resonance amplifiers somehow. All I know is that Marshall went to the research sector to secure the HRA production after the his first attacked. So... Marshall seems like our best lead on Dylan. I need to go after her. How can I get to the research sector? Use my key card. The sector elevator will take you there. Marshall is the next step. What Emily told me about ordinary, my powers being connected to things in the Bureau's past. I am so close to something. Do you feel it? Something's coming. 
We take turns to come for a visit. I helped you. You owe me now. And when time comes, I will come calling. And Marshall. Does that mean I only have a time limit to get there and do it? Well, let's go check. Yeah, it does, because it's counting down. Mm -hmm. I think this is the right place to go. Hmm. Close enough. Hmm. I think. That's the way to the control room. And through the control room, I can get to the converter, so. That didn't work out as planned. Hmm. I failed it because I died, huh? Okay. Let's go see if I can burn the trash around the furnace. Hmm.
Okay, so where is the furnace? This has to be the furnace area, huh? Or it's in there, huh? It's probably through that area. I can't go yet. Oh. Let's go see if I can get into the training course now. Yes, here it is. So, I think it has something to do with these. Does. Um, I thought so. Hmm. Field training course. The course must be completed in the 
specified amount of time. When you're ready to start, press the button. Is that all, or...? I always did love obstacle courses. Get ready, Ranger. Course starting in five, four, three, two, one. Go. Five seconds remaining. Thirty seconds. failed. Try again, Ranger. I was that close. It's because I didn't start. Get ready, Ranger. Right away. We're starting in five, four, three, two, one. Go. Sixty seconds for me. Thirty seconds remaining. Fifteen seconds remaining. Course complete. Congratulations, Ranger. Guessing this isn't usually part of the course. Probably it's not. Touching itself. It's a safe home.
That was easy. I thought he was going to be harder to defeat. Yeah, you can't go through the glass. I thought you might be able to. Hmm. Atlas chamber. Hmm. Okay. I don't think I can come in here yet. Which way do I need to go? Hmm. I don't know. Reach parapsychology. You know? Where's that? Oh. Let's go back up here and see if I can find a way through there. Hmm. Psychology, huh?
has asked us to document the his incantation, she calls it. You mean like in... In person? In person, with a pencil and paper. I think she's trying to get us killed. This is the way I came originally. So I don't think it's that way. I don't know which way to go. I must have missed that my first time through. If it's through there, hmm.
research sector. So where's the research sector, huh? Not through there, hmm?
Okay, Emily, where am I supposed to go? Where's the research? Why did they start acting like that? That red light got him. I think it's a different floor. Hmm. Oh, right there, research sector. I guess I should have seen that. Hmm. discoveries, authored studies of grave importance, and in all this work, there is one thing we know, and that's how little we truly know. Rest assured, we're committed to keep pushing the known laws and borders of reality, and to make the Bureau proud. So, welcome, assuming you have the necessary clearance, and, and do follow the safety protocols. Read the manual, otherwise bad things will happen. Research sector, huh? Home of the Bureau's mad scientists.
I found parapsychology. Mm -hmm. It's the safe. Let's go look back up in here now that the combat's all over. Hmm. At least I think it is. I've been fielding questions recently regarding HRAs. What are they for? Do you always need to wear them? And. What's the deal with the Hedron Resonance anyway? I... Fuck. Despite what you may have heard, HRAs are not monitoring devices. We're not tracking your movements. We're listening to your conversations while you're wearing them. You do that regardless whether or not you're wearing an HRA. Think of them as a, as a uh, life preserver. Only instead of water, the, the thing HRAs protect you from is um, classified. One day that classified, not water, might pour in and you'll be glad you got, a, got an HRA keeping you afloat. And if you don't have an HRA, don't worry. It'll be uh, quick and painless. <laughs> kidding. I'm kidding. We're making more. Your office is a mess.
bribery, is it? Hmm. Okay. Oh boy, more bad guys. There's another bear guy. Um,
And why am I back up here? Now well, I'm gonna see if I can upgrade anything. guessing the hiss's motives if we don't even know what kind of energy it uses. What do you mean? If you have made it to this point of the video and have enjoyed it, please take a minute to like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, click the notification bell, share with a friend, and comment below what you thought about the video. I will see you in the next part of Jesse's story, and until then, check out some of my other videos, and thank you for watching.